Hey y'all. So basically I want to do like a little mullet style, but I want to use this wig that I got. So it is a five by five closure. I want to try something new. The last time I did it, which was here, I actually got someone to do it and then basically use it a frontal. But the thing about it was it wasn't as extended on the size as I would have liked it to be. So I'm going to go ahead and use it and do the mother freaking. Um, I'm going to do the closure. Also, I want to let you guys know I am going to be collaborating with two companies in this video. I'm going to be collaborating with EAP Heat by Ming Lee. You know, that's my girl or whatever. And then I'm also going to be collaborating with Accords Beauty Forever here. So let's go ahead and get into this chat. I'm a little nervous, but we're going to see what I come up with. So with my personal part, I want it to be on. Which side do I want to be on? This is my part side. Pretty much. Okay. So I want it right where my freaking baby is. is. And I didn't let me mind you, I didn't plug this wig at all. I didn't do anything to it except for bleach the knots and dyed it black. So with me going through, I'm just gonna make sure I go through piece by piece by piece and see where it gets me because I'm gonna take my time. I'm low-key. I'm going Look, you're a little nervous because I ain't did this before. My lips dry. Hold on one moment. So with my last one, it was cute, but I want to change certain things about it. Like I want my part to be a lot more deeper. I want it to just be more like, you know, the girl. So I think this is right where I want my part to be. I mean, my ear is a little something, but I think I'm going to just cut that a little bit. So with this, I'm going to make my part like right here. So let me have my little deep part. So I just want to make sure it is clean. I did a braid in the front. I did a braid in the back. And then I got this side part. This is the area I'm working with. Right now, I'm just going to take my hot comb and like press it the hell out oh child this thing is hot i will have a list in the description of things i feel like you will need so now i'm gonna put on my wig head just to see what my wig head is doing with it and then try to figure out my party situation okay y'all so basically i did this oh that part looked crispy Okay, child. And then I got the second little one. So I'm going to cut here and shape that and do it right. And then I'm going to go back in and do that part. I need to get my hair scissors. I don't know where I put them at, but mind you, I have not done no plucking or nothing yet. So give it time. And since this is a frontal, I'm going to have to low key kind of finesse it because it's not going to have normal ear tabs. So I think I'm going to have to cut it along this portion just to kind of get it to be exactly how I want it to be. So this is the part I'm cutting. Um, it's not on the lace, but it's right behind this little binding part, security part, because it's gonna make it lay flatter. So, let me, ch let me ch see, chill. Okay. A lot more snug and comfortable. See? I don't want nothing making my ears stick out like an elf now. Okay, so I'm gonna like just cut all that down. Really just cut it down. See this? Y'all see this my ear tab. So I'm gonna just take this part and twist it around this. This part, I'm actually going to cut it. So let's see. It needs to be short, so I'm gonna start right here where my ear is. Oh, 
Okay, so now I'm looking at it, I feel like this doesn't need to stay down here. I feel like this part, it's not bad. I just feel like, I'm gonna take the guard off. Bitch, I'm not taking the guard off, but I know what I'm doing. I'm gonna just take some off. Okay, so I'm back. I don't know why I got this on, but I'm back. <laughs> and I laid this down. So let me see what it's giving. It should be flat as heck. Chopper a little got to be on it, to be honest. I ain't even okay. Oh my God, it's so flat. Oh, that little icy bitch. So good. But this part, I am gonna press the hell out of it. Because it needs to be flat. And I have this, uh, this is my Kendra's Boutique um, hot comb. And this is probably the best hot comb I ever used. I had told y'all plenty of times, I went to Arrogant Taste class. And this is the one he recommended. Baby, I did that on the mother freaking knots. And also, I am going to start plucking it. Okay, so basically I sectioned off the hair that I want in the front. Like I said, this wig is pretty thick and I'm not using the, this is the closure part, but you gotta figure this is like actually little track sewed in, so it's gonna be a lot thicker than a frontal. So y'all probably wouldn't, if you're using a frontal, you wouldn't need this much. If you're using a closure, you probably use about the same amount. Um, so I'm gonna use this part for my little ear tab because I want a little piece for my ear tab. And then I'm just going to in this right here. I think this is what I'm going to cut. Don't worry. I'm going to cut in doses. So with this part, I'm actually going to take it and wrap it around the back. Even though, you know, keep it out of the way. And then I'm actually going to brush it how it should lay. Now this is how it should lay. This is how it should lay. And then I'm going to, I want to, so it's my closure. Don't worry, I'm gonna mold this down too. <laughs> I'm gonna cut this long and then I'm gonna go short.
because honestly, <laughs> look at my back. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and try to mold this little part. It looks so good. It's the first reveal of it in the next day because I had to literally lay everything down. I be nervous when I be trying to cut this thing. Ooh. Period. That looks so good. It looks so good. So now I just have to go through and straighten it. And then I'm done. Okay, so here's my wig. Here it is. It's really good. Okay, so period. Now I'm about to put it on. Okay, you guys, so this is pretty much the final look. I was so happy with it, and pretty much I haven't even cut the lace off. The lace on this wig was magnificent, very transparent. As you guys see, it's already blending in because it's so thin, and it just fits with my skin tone. It's crazy, though. I think it would pretty much fit with any skin tone, honestly, because it's just that transparent. I really, really did like this wig style. I feel like the wig was thick enough for me to achieve this style. So it's definitely a great wig for this and you don't have to use a frontal. I prefer the closure because it does allow it to be a lot longer with the five by five. But I hope you guys enjoy. I wanna do more creative stuff like this. And you know, I really, really enjoyed this. So can't wait to see you guys in my next video. Mwah. See ya.